What we did was expose American babies during this period to Mandarin. It was like having Mandarin relatives come and visit for a month and move into your house and talk to the babies for 12 sessions. Here's what it looked like in the laboratory. So what have we done to their little brains? <laughs> we, we had to run a control group to make sure that just coming into the laboratory didn't improve your Mandarin skills. So a group of babies came in and listened to English, and we can see from the graph that exposure to English didn't improve their Mandarin. But look what happened to the babies exposed to Mandarin for 12 sessions. They were as good as the babies in Taiwan who'd been listening for 10 and a half months. What it demonstrated is that babies take statistics on a new language. Whatever you put in front of them, they'll take statistics on. But we wondered what role the human being played in this um, learning exercise. So we ran another group of babies in which the kids were get the same dosage, the same 12 sessions, but over a television set. And another group of babies who had just audio exposure and looked at a teddy bear on the screen. What did we do to their brains? What you see here is the audio result, no learning whatsoever, and the video result no learning whatsoever. It takes a human being for babies to take their statistics.